welcome to Jango's Journey Part 4. Today it's going to be a bit different because I'm going to be painting a box. This box looks a bit like a creeper from Minecraft. I'll probably edit a photo into it so you can see. Um, but here's the box and it's quite big. So today I've got got these paints, got my paintbrush, and I'm gonna kind of cut out black squares onto, onto and then stick them on, and that will be our, the creeper. Now maybe I can get in it to end the video. Who knows? Okay, let's do this.
took a little while. Now uh, I'm going to be I'm going to be cutting out black squares to go on the creeper's body. So got to do a whole bunch of these. Might take a little while. See you then. Okay, I have now cut up all of my little squares. So I've got tons of small squares, and then I've got a couple of big squares. So next, I'm going to go and stick these onto the box, and then it should be all done. So let's go do that. Okay, I'm back down with the box, and I've got some PVA glue, a brush. So let's get gluing. now it's to dry so I've now just got to play a waiting game see how long it takes for it to dry and then as soon as it's dry I'm going to try it on and then you guys will be able to see it so that will be cool see you then it has worked ok that's just about going to wrap it up for this video I hope you enjoyed this is my creeper outfit it's very cool, and um, I know I was meant to do Boris the Snake through this video, but I decided, well, this came up, uh, so I thought, why don't I do this instead? So, it's very, it's very dark in here. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I know creepers are not supposed to have arms, but how else am I going to hold the camera? So, thanks for watching. Goodbye!